And who am I? That's one secret I'll never tell. The only one. XOXO Gossip Girl. another vlog today is my first day of classes um, I'm very tired it's literally 7 a.m. but it was raining all night and so it's pretty dark outside it's supposed to be beautiful and sunny today we'll see what happens but yeah if you're new here hi I'm Vanessa I'm going into my third year of university at U of T if you're from the States that's University of Toronto I have a super busy day today for some reason, my first days are always a Wednesday and they are always, like Wednesdays are always my ridiculously heavy class day. I don't know how that happens, but that's what happens. So I have classes starting at 10 a.m., which is nice because if you were here last year, you'll know that I started class at 8 a.m. That was not it. <laughs> so I have classes starting at 10 a.m. till 2 p.m., then I have a break from 2 till 3, then I have classes from 3 till 7 gonna be a really crazy day but I'm excited to bring you guys along I'm excited to get this year started I'm honestly I feel very unprepared for my classes today but hopefully it's just like going through the syllabuses and stuff um, yeah let's go make breakfast I'm hungry <laughs> or a coffee or anything because I'm very excited um, I was looking last night just I was curious to see if the Starbucks was open on campus there actually was two Starbucks on campus um, but one of them one of them is open so we are going to go get something pumpkin for my first day of classes this morning I'm very excited I haven't had Starbucks in a good bit and the fact that the one that is on campus is open now is great because they closed the one that is on the way to the bus. I always used to get coffee at the corner of the bus stop. I'd go get my Starbucks, get on the bus, go to classes. It was great, but they closed that one because of COVID. I'm very sad, but they opened the Starbucks on campus. So we are, we are rocking. We are great. I'm, I'm very happy to go get to Starbucks. I'm exhausted and I, Honestly, I just want a little treat for the first day of classes. I don't really want to make coffee or a matcha or anything. So we're going to get Starbucks on campus.
right, so here is my fruit bowl for breakfast. We had the skur yogurt on the bottom, mango, banana, raspberries, coconut, cinnamon, and cacao nibs. This, I feel like, is my classic yogurt bowl. Most of the time, my classic yogurt bowl used to be just mango and banana, but I have raspberries today. Do I wear a sweater vest yet? Like, is it sweater vest season? My phone says it's supposed to be 26 outside. It's still looking pretty gray. I don't know. Here's the outfit of the day. I'm just wearing these super wide-legged jeans from Zara top from 437 white button up from gap literally this is just a variation on my literally what i've been wearing all summer i have been loving so much little tank tops bra tops white shirt over top any sort of pants we just have to do my makeup now and then go my goal was to try and be on campus by around 8 30 it's currently 8 and i just have to do my makeup and then i'm ready to go so i should be able Hopefully to make that. There was a bus at 8.20 and then it takes about 10 minutes to get to campus. So, not bad at all. I think we'll be able to do it. Let's do my makeup. We're just gonna do a little chat while I do my makeup. My mirror is here in front of the, like, this way. So if I'm, like, not looking at the camera, that's why. If I'm not directly talking to you guys, I'm sorry. But, as I've mentioned a few times before, but just for the people that are new here, I literally have all online classes. I just enjoy being on campus and getting up as if I was going to actual classes just because it gives me more of a routine and then also if classes go in person in the winter semester I'm already kind of ready and in a routine. But I have one in-person tutorial on Fridays. That is it. I'm not gonna lie I'm a little disappointed for not having more in-person classes and I understand that like a giant portion of our school population is international students but like I don't know I know Alan has mostly in-person classes I think I know he was telling me that he he might have only like one or two online classes and everything else is in person and I'm very jealous of him for that because I love in-person classes and I miss it so so much um so I'll be looking forward to this in-person tutorial Mind you, it's at 10 a.m. on Fridays, so it's a little bit of a pain, but like, it's better than nothing. I will take it. But it's just been, it's been hard hearing some people having in-person classes and then, you know, me having none. At least I have the one tutorial that kind of like, is a savoring grace. Savoring. Saving, saving grace? That's, that's more correct. Also, for the people that are new here, because I know I'm gonna get asked what, like, major, minor, what program I'm in. So I'm doing a major in biology for health sci with a minor in business and a minor in chem. The original thought when I first started school was to go to med school. Currently, um, currently I'm more so leaning towards going for my master's in physical therapy. But we'll, we'll see where life takes me. I know I literally only have two years of school left, but like I'm in no rush. To do anything because I love what I currently do. I'm kind of just going slow seeing where life takes me if I end up getting my master's and then I want to go back to school and do med school or take a year off and then you know volunteer and take my MCAT and then go to med school. Who knows guys? I know some people are still like med school, med school, med school but I'm like if I want to do it I know that if I work hard enough I can do it and I'll get there. Um, it's just a matter of like I don't know if that's really what I want to do. So there's a little honest chat for this morning. I'm gonna finish my makeup because clock is starting to tick and we are gonna go to campus. Symphony, 
Souls connect so physically, yeah. Come to shine like laser beams. Wanna feel your energy, yeah. I'm hearing you songs. Your voice leading the choir to sing. If you don't mind me asking to be heard, my heart beats with yours. You can take me on I'm falling deep, it won't take long So breathe the energy With a bit of Hennessy We both skies and autumn leaves Take all the chances that we need I've been driving too long, gets out of control If only when you had a close I promise I'll hold your hand till it gets old And all the lights come to a close da 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 A symphony, souls connect so physically. Yeah, da 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 all right, so I'm done at my first three lectures of the day. We're heading back home now for lunch because I didn't pack a lunch today and I also didn't want to be on campus until 8 p.m. So I'm gonna go home, make lunch, and then I have my lectures, like I was saying earlier, from 3 p.m. till 7 p.m. It's so nice, not gonna lie, to see people walking around campus because last year when I came on campus, like, there was nobody. It was dead, silent. There was like me and like, for the people on campus so it's nice to see people walking around like there's life <laughs> here on campus and like i know there's in-person classes like i said i don't personally have any i have my one on fridays and that's it but other than that it's kind of nice to just see somewhat of a normal campus life <laughs> All right, I'm back home now. I just made a quick lunch. I just did a little kale quinoa salad with avocado, goat cheese, cucumber, tomato, and chicken. And then my favorite homemade dressing recently has been olive oil, lemon juice, and salt and pepper, and chef's kiss. You guys know that normally I just would do balsamic vinegar drizzle that on top, but this is a little bit different, and it, it's a little bit different. It's nice. So I'm gonna eat this. Oh, I'm also having a dose juice. This is just the cactus one. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna eat this. I have my next class at 3. It's currently 2.40, so I have 20 minutes to eat and kind of just chill before my next class. Um, I also wanted to say, very exciting, we are so close to hitting 200k. I think we're literally at like 199, like 500 right now. I'm gonna pull it up and check. Yeah, we are at 199,567. So I have a feeling we're going to hit 200k today. I really hope so. My mom actually sent me home with this box um, and said not to open it until I hit 200k. So I'm hoping that I can hit 200k and open up the box on today's vlog. That would be so much fun because like first day of classes and I honestly forgot how exhausting online classes are. Like <laughs> it's only 3 p.m. and I'm like wiped. But it would be so nice to kind of just like end the day with this support prize um and hitting 200k because that's crazy we literally just hit 100k back in january which i know we haven't hit it yet but like we're so close so i'm just gonna say thank you i love you all so much and the support you've all given me recently i am honestly overwhelmed and so thankful for you all like i couldn't have gotten here without you so thank you and i can't wait to keep growing our family and hitting the next milestone like craziness Anyways, um, I'm gonna sit here, I'm gonna eat my lunch, and then my next class is statistics, and then this evening I have, I can't remember if it's my biology human development anatomy course, or if it's my fundamentals of marketing course. I don't remember, <laughs> but that's what's up, that's what's happening. Um, I'm sorry if the vlog at campus was a little bit short. There will be lots more study days, um, study day vlogs with me on campus. You guys will see lots more of campus, lots more of me studying on campus. But I feel like I felt a little rushed and I wasn't... And there was also lots of people. I was a little shocked by how many people were on campus. 
But anyways, I'm gonna eat lunch and then we're gonna have my next class. You guys, I just finished my stats class. So I have a little bit of time before my next class and I was checking my phone to see if we hit 200K and we hit 200K. I'm so, thank you, thank you all so much. I'm so thankful and so grateful for you, <laughs> for you all. I know I just like spieled before my last class, but let's open the box that my mom gave me together. Okay, I have a good feeling that I know what this is, but I don't know what it looks like. So here we go. Oh my goodness. So if you guys didn't know, my mom does like smash hearts and smash cakes and stuff. These are so pretty. Oh my goodness, like rose gold, pink and gold. I definitely will be enjoying eating those tonight. Okay, maybe not all of them, but like at least one of them. I have a feeling those are the brownie ones. Those are my favorite of the ones that my mom makes. Anyways, I have another class now. So, last class of the day, guys. I'm exhausted, but we're gonna get through it. We're doing class introductions in my marketing class and um I'm coming up. I'm like I I hate this stuff. Like I'm literally like shaking and we have to do class introductions. I have to put my camera on and talk. We'll be okay. Hi everyone, I'm Vanessa. I'm majoring in bio for health sci and my blue object is this white out. All right, it's just past 6 p.m. I threw on my blue light glasses. I can actually take these off while I'm talking to you guys. Um, because like about 15 minutes into my lecture, my 5 p.m. lecture, so almost all my lectures are done for the day. I started getting that headache and my eyes started getting tired. I'm like, mm, blue, blue light glasses time. So I threw these bad boys on. Um, we're just breaking right now. We have a 10 minute break and I still have another hour of my marketing lecture to go, but we're almost done. We're almost there. I also threw on a hoodie just over top the tank top I was wearing earlier because I got cold and that shirt was not doing it. While we're on a little 10 minute break, I'm actually going to go through and do some planning um i wrote down like all of the quizzes and test dates and stuff in my notes on my, on my ipad today during my classes so i'm just gonna go through and mark them up in my planner in my calendar so that i have them there and i'm doing it now on my class break because i know that if i don't do it now i'm likely gonna forget to do it later and then i will just I'll forget. So we're doing it now. Marketing class has been interesting so far. I was very tempted. So if you guys saw, they asked us for an icebreaker to show a blue item. I was very tempted to show a Cerise Dawn hoodie, but I was like, nah, we're not going to be that person. So I just was like, yep. Awkward little me was like, here's my little blue whiteout. Did a little laugh. Literally did a little laugh. Put myself on mute and was like, yep, there we go. Anyways, let's plan. Also, if you didn't watch my back to school supplies haul, this is my beautiful planner. I'm literally obsessed with it. Just this gray, it says 2022. It's August 2021 20, to December 2022. I got it at Indigo. She was uh, not that much because I got it on discount, but $26 regular price, but she is stunning. To compare, this was my last year's one and I used this style of one for two years. Didn't love the layout of it, but the layout of this one, let me tell you, first off, we have all the months in a big layout, which I love because I can write in like test dates and stuff and flip through here and see them. But the weekly layout is what I love. We've got this big space here for every day. We've got a notes section. We got a to-do section. We have reminders, goals of the week, and little baby calendars. I literally am just obsessed with this layout and have been enjoying it very much so far. Not gonna 
lie, this outfit right now, it's kind of a vibe. But anyways, I am done my classes for the day, so I'm gonna end off my vlog here, my first day of college, university, whatever you call it, whether you're in the States or Canada. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Hopefully I will see you in the next vlog, and I love you guys so much. Bye! Mm -hmm.